Now, for this question, um, x squared minus 2x is equal to 15. The first thing you're going to do is isolate all of the terms on one side of the equation. And so this will be x squared minus 2x minus 15 equals 0. So now we've got to factor this trinomial. And if you recall, we have to find two numbers that have a product of negative 15 and a sum of negative 2. And the two numbers then are going to be negative, three, negative 5 and positive 3. Because negative 5 times positive 3 is negative 15, and negative 5 plus, po po plus positive 3 is negative 2. And so this is all equal to 0. So now what we, can, we have to do is find what value of x makes the first bracket equal to 0, and that'll give us one of the roots. So x minus 5 equals 0, and by inspection you should see that x is equal to 5. Or x plus 3 has to be equal to 0, and subtract 3 from both sides or solve by inspection, x is equal to 0 minus 3 is negative 3. So the two possible answers are x equals 5 and x equals negative 3. And so that means that this parabola, if you were to graph it, would cross the x-axis at 5 and at negative 3. Um, A is positive, so open upwards. So it would look something like this. And the axis of symmetry would be along x equals 1 because that's halfway between negative 3 and positive 5. All right, so this is some of the things that you're going to have to start thinking about when you um, start figuring out why you're solving for quadratic equations.